G'day guys, welcome back to another video tutorial with me, Zarius. Today, I am going to build you a prisoner transport bus. And as you see, it's outside, little derpy uh, prison wall here. But this is the, uh, the bus that I'm going to be teaching you. And it comes with, if you hop inside, it comes with all the seating, gear stick, door, prisoner guard and all the uh, prisoner bits and pieces as far as the chains that are attached to the handcuffs and I'm going to teach you how to do this today so let's clear out all the inventory and I'm building this again in flows HD and uh, yeah this is what we do so what you're going to need is coal blocks black wool slabs light gray stained glass and uh, iron bars, very easy. And we'll build it right here. So put down your first block, leave one, two, three, and place another block. So you've got a three space gap in the center. It's gonna be five wide guys. Then you're gonna leave, so it'll be one, two, tire. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, leave a space, and another block, and leave two more spaces at the back, and we're just going to put them in line like that. So there is your tire position. With your slabs, you're going to come out two at the front, one, two, I'm going to connect it all up like this, and you're going to run that all the way back like so and connect it in here leave two at the back bring it right through and like this now this bus here can be converted into a normal bus a normal civilian bus picking up from a shopping mall or anything of your discretion but I thought, well, I haven't seen a prisoner transport vehicle on Minecraft, and I know a lot of people have built prisons, and so, yeah, I had to build one. Okay, so, we've got that happening. Now, with your black wool, I'm gonna place one at the front here, and one at the front here. Then what we're gonna do is we are gonna grab our dispensers. And I like using dispensers because these little grooves and markings and it leaves little black holes here looks like an air vent so we grab our ladders and place three across just like that and whilst we're here as well we may as well grab all our bits and pieces so we need signs like that we grab our red stained glass panes and we'll go and grab our glass blocks this and we'll just get rid of the bars for a minute. Item frame, item frame, glass block and glass block. Signs one, one, two, three, one. So that's your front. All right, then grab your black wool again. You're going to count one, two, three, four, leave a space. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And you're going to cover that in all the way. And you're going to do this all the way down. All right. Now, grab your light, gleam, light gray stained glass. And we're going to place it all along the front, just like that. And we are going to continue that, just like that. So it's going to be a flat face. All right, here, you're gonna come out by three. So three blocks there and one on top. Same again this side. Because this is gonna change uh, over here at some point through the tutorial. Okay, now that we've got this happening, go back to your black wool and you're gonna come up and you're gonna fill all this in just like that. And you're gonna run this all the way back, right to the end like that and 
come around like this and all the way back down to the front. Voila. Now, with your glass again, you're going to actually fill that bit in there so it's just a doorway. With your glass, just fill that in all the way right round the actual bus itself and continue that all the way like that. Okay. Your next step is actually we'll just put our wheels in at the moment like this and like that. La -di -da, -di da Boom. And we'll go around one more time by putting our blocks of iron in. Like this. Oh, not like that. Oh, not like that at all. Oh dear. Just like that. And over the other side we go. One there, one there, and the last one. Boom. Right. So there is the basic shape of what we're trying to make. Now, what we're going to do is, well, is grab some buttons. So we're going to grab some concrete buttons and some wood buttons. And with the wood buttons, we're going to place them on the corners as our indicators. We'll fly down here like that and like that. Whilst we're at the back now, guys, we'll put our frames in again with our red stained glass panes and with our signs one two three just pop them across there and we'll just pop them on down the bottom as well like that okay now I'm just gonna double check something here because I think I might have made a mistake one two three no okay so right here one, two, three. We're going to knock out that there and we're going to put in a door. Uh, do this now. There you go. Door. And we'll pop one over on the other side. Just like that. Okay. Now, we've got two spacings there. And what we're going to do now, guys, is grab ourselves. Some iron bars and we'll do this early on so we grab one and we'll just follow it along all the glass like that come out on the side and connect it all through like this la -di da -di da -di da and there and I'm not sure what have I done here one two three okay so knock these out there, cover that one in, cover that one in. So on the left, on the right hand side, you've got space one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. On the seventh one, put in a black block, glass block, and then just cover in the door. And then just run that right there. With your signs, fill it all in. there as well. We're going to do it all the way across. See? And we'll do it on this side as well, whilst we're here. Like that. And that. Okay, so now with our concrete buttons, I'm going to place one there, so that way, I'm um, it's a normal door, but you can still get the feel for the doors. And we'll put one, yeah, we'll put one here as well. Okay, so, the roofing. Go back to your slabs, and on the front, just place your slabs, like that, and run that all the way towards the end. Not like that. And like this. And 
down and we'll just fill it all in. Isn't it fun? The most the most busiest part of Minecraft is just filling in open spaces like this. I mean I could world edit. But what's the fun in that? Better have some fun. Alright, so now we've got that happening. We've closed it all in. Close all these off. At the back here, you're gonna leave a space. And right there and there, you're gonna put a double block we're going to use player heads again. Here you're going to leave a block and then you're going to go six, so three, six, and nine. So three by three, by three by three, yeah, you get it. One, two, leave a space and do the same again. Three, six, nine. That is your roof complete. With your signs, you're going to come to the front and you're going to place one, two, three, and there you're just going to have, you know, if you want to type prisoner transport vehicle or prisoner transfer, something like that. Um, right, where am I? Right here, and it doesn't matter where you put it, uh, and it's just for more filling. Usually it has state penitentiary written on it, but we're just going to run three signs just like that a bit of filling and if you want to know where there's the back tire leave a block then place three that way and what we'll do as well we will go over and do it on this side leave a space one two three like that Pick out this one place it so that is the bus so far. Okay, now inside. So we hop in and we've got all this empty space happening. So what we're going to do is we're going to come right by here and we're going to place a seat followed by a sign followed by a door. That way you can still get in and you can still get out if you're the driver. Here in the center, we are going to place a lever because that's going to be his uh, gear knob. Right there, we're going to place a uh, picture frame followed by a record slash steering wheel. Grab some slabs, three slabs just there. Don't know what that is, just a bit of extra filling. And right here, we're going to get our iron bars again. We're just going to close off the cabin to the driver. Voila, just like that. Okay, right here in this spot, what we're going to do is grab some um, dark oak wood stairs and place that there directly in front of the window. Now we go down here and we place the stairs by leaving a gap to every stair. Just like that. Okay. Here, what we're going to do is grab some iron bars and we're going to run that right across again, just like this. In the grooves, we're going to place buttons because that's where you're going to be sitting down you'd be handcuffed to the actual wall of the bus just like this and back down again like so that part is complete guys you could if you wanted to close it in I'd leave it open because it just makes it more realistic place it in there and one there so you're barred off there, and you're barred off there, and the security guard, you'll hold a gun, whatever. Sign just up the top for extra, uh, know, extra detail. Probably hang a gun up there. And a button on there for extra detail. Yeah, that looks good. So we can close that off. Okay. Now, that is pretty much done. All you've got left to do now is grab a lever, 
coming back down here, grab your levers and drop your lever one there and one over here, which I haven't done there. And also grab yourself some light gray stained glass. And that is going to be our side mirrors. Just like that. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, so if you want to do the lights, we could... Well, if you've got... Uh, just place box there. If you've got world edit, this is going to work to your advantage. If you haven't, you don't necessarily have to have lights. You can use uh, glass panes or something like that. But for people who have got world edit, left click, right click. That is what you use. And you also use a stick to just pop it into place. And we'll do the same again. One, two, set skull. And I think this one is Z tag 100. And that will give you the blue. And we may as well do it again over this side, opposite directions. Just put a stair there and a stair there. One and two, set skull, Z tag 100. And all these uh, player heads will be in the description down below, so don't worry if you uh, if you panic and think that we don't have it. Go runner. There we go. And that is your prisoner transfer vehicle slash prisoner bus from the courts. I think it looks pretty amazing, to be honest. And like I said, this can be transferred into a normal, a normal bus. All you have to do, if you want to convert this into a normal pedestrian bus, is whack out the loco runner and Z-tag player heads, knock out that slab, lay it all flat, change the colors of the slabs to white or whatever color you want keep that because that's what buses usually have change the color from black wool to white or whatever color you like definitely remove the bars <laughs> you don't want to go shopping with iron bars on there and uh, just remove these little signs here but apart from that that is your prisoner bus for any prison that you've created on your local world. So guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video tutorial, please hit the thumbs up. Would really much appreciate it. Place a comment down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And guys, until next time, I will catch you on the next one.